It's a very hungry organ. It wouldn't be soaking up 20% of our oxygen and food if it wasn't doing something if you're only using 10% of it. One fun myth about the brain that is very common is that we only use 10% of our brain. And of course it's not true. We use pretty much all of our brain. What's interesting is where the myth derives from, and it's not really clear. You know, people have tried to backtrack and see where does it come from. Uh, at some point in the 19th century, uh, scientists commented that we've only figured out what 10% of the brain does, or 12% sometimes is the figure. But that doesn't mean that the other 90% isn't doing anything, just means it hadn't mapped it yet. It's amazing how much that has gotten into the popular culture. Even you'll see movies. Most human beings only use 10% of the brain's capacity. In fact, where the protagonist gets superpowers because because they start using more than 10% of their brain. You use all of your brain. We could see the whole brain light up, you know, when you're, when you're doing cognitively demanding tasks. It doesn't make any evolutionary or biological sense that you wouldn't be using 90% of that hungry organ sitting at the top of your neck.